Welcome back to another edition of the Rural Report. I am your Rural 2IC, and I'm going to come to you with hopefully a short video. I know every time I say it's short, it usually runs 20 minutes or something, but um, I was perusing around uh, Facebook, and one of the prepping channels that I follow had the letters S-H-T-F. Right there. That's it. And then above it, they wrote in, what is, because uh, you, you prepare for the worst and hope for the best, okay? What is your worst case scenario SHTF situation? And I went through, and it was kind of relatively new, and I did go back and peek at it, you know, gave it a little bit of time, because I wanted to see what a lot of people's responses was, and I'm actually curious. So before I get into this, what is yours? Leave it down in the comments. What is your absolute worst case SHTF situation? If you need to, pause it, put it in there, then come back. Now, I went ahead because it gave me a few minutes and I thought about it and I did my reply. So, as of right now, the making of this video... My worst case SHTF situation would be that the current conflict overseas in the, the Middle East area will actually expand and become regional, which would very short term expand and become a global conflict. Now, once it becomes a global conflict, I believe that it would lead to a worldwide supply chain Shortage, disruption, if not collapse. Now, once that happens, that would lead to a very big economic crisis, probably globally. Once that happens, then I would see that you would have sort of a civil unrest that would probably lead to grid failures, disruptions, maybe even a total collapse, all taking place during winter. Now that I lay down uh, your answer and my answer, you know, I, I saw a bunch of people. Well, uh, power grid failure during winter. Yeah, but I, I, that's in mine. Uh, this might turn out to be World War III. That's my answer. Uh, I'm worried about the financial collapse, in my answer. <laughs> I took the absolute worst that I can possibly think of and dominoed them. This happens, that goes to this, that leads to this, that comes to here, comes to here. Is my answer going to happen? I don't know, and I really hope it doesn't. I want this video, because it'll be posted on the internet, to live in complete infinity of people coming back year after year after year going, hey, you were wrong, that didn't happen, that would make me happy. I love to be wrong when it comes to the worst case scenario stuff. Will part of it happen? Probably. There's a, there's a better chance of some of it happening than all of it happening. Um, will one of those things happen? Again, the probability goes higher. Um, I think once one happens, it'll probably lead to at the very least a couple of things happening, but we will see as time goes. Now, that is a lot of very bad, destructive, horrible things that I just laid out there. And the really bad part is it doesn't take that long for all that stuff to play out. When you get a domino effect, that chain reaction, one thing can lead to the other in an extremely short amount of time. We're talking 90 days, 60 days, somewhere around in there. And could be six months. I mean, it's still a very short amount of time. So I'm curious. That, that was my answer. Again, hoping that doesn't happen ever, ever in the history of the planet and the future of the planet. But what is yours? What is your worst case SHTF situation? Leave them down in the comments. And actually, tell you what, 
I will go through the comments, and depending on how many people uh, interact with this, I'll go through and I will share them. And we'll do a video to see what the subscribers here think of what theirs is. I'm curious to see what it is. So, uh, more information to come. Do all the fun YouTube stuff. Hit the like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. That way you can be notified for all future content that I create. And with that, remember to remain united because we're all prepping in this together.